All right, welcome to episode 24 of Southern Cross Station. Um, today we're going to try and uh, make some money. This will be uh, episode, I think I said 24, did I not? Yes, okay, I did. Now that I think of it. Um, the, what, right now, what we need to do is we need to get the bales off of uh, field, uh, I forget what number it is, the, not number one, but the other, our other field over there, the one the the, gra the grain field anyway um we've got the tractor set up to do uh to try and get canola set up on the on field 26 and but i wanted to do this first uh, we do not have enough money to do what i want to do so um what we're going to do we're going to come in here and we're going to actually we're going to lease this trailer we're going to buy it down the road but uh actually Wait, will that work? Um, 240s. Yep. Okay. Just wanted to make sure it would actually handle both of them. Now we are, because I am horrible, if you've watched my other video, you've seen that we bought an auto loader on there as well. I am horrible at that stuff. So, uh, we're just going to go ahead and we're going to lease this. So it's only like, you know, just under 4,000 bucks. So shouldn't cut into our profits too much because, uh, grass and straw do go for an okay amount. I mean, nothing fancy, but if we're going to continue with the square bales, we're probably going to uh, buy a wrapper down the road so that we can wrap them. But I'm thinking about going and getting the first load off the field, and then we're going to uh, do some other stuff. So I will uh, see you when we get over to the farm. All right, so here we are back on the farm. We're going to start. I've already got this thing in. Uh, in operating position so we're gonna see how many bales i think if i remember this thing holds 36. so we're gonna grab 36 of these if there are not 36 on this field we'll go over and pick up the grass uh, bales and go from there But, I mean, we do have a mixed load, you know, so. But I think what we're going to do, we're going to wait to take this over. But, as you probably noticed, the John Deere is not on the, you know, not on the farm. So, we're going to jump over here to the John Deere. Which, I probably got lucky there. Um, usually, I don't get that lucky and get the tractor that I want first. But, yeah. Okay, so let's just get on here enough and we'll sell the honey completely. Because I'm assuming it'll get us some money. Now, we are going to take this back at some point and reload it, you know, so... Uh, but it's going to sit here for right now. I don't want to move it too far. But now we're going to go to this tractor. Yeah, maybe let's get this all started. I want to get... Uh, the plan is uh, the planters right over there. Um, the plan for this field, is, I think, right now is even though we're in the second half of it, I want to put um, canola in because we haven't had canola for a little while. These are uh, June and July for uh, best times to sell, so uh, we're not in a big hurry for them. And I was, oops, helps. I guess it helps if I actually drop the unit down to the ground um but uh i've been thinking you know we've been talking about actually putting factories in on this map or at least i have been um and i'm thinking i want to figure out i think it's cake or something like that but there's something that d that uses honey and i thought well you know we're getting a ton of honey why can't we uh you know, do the honey up and just directly ship it to uh, wherever we need it. Because we can actually distribute it. And then once we do that, then we'll start focusing on whatever other items, I'm guessing flour and stuff like that, that we're going to need to make whatever, you know, that can be made with honey and stuff, you know. 
but uh, yeah, I just I haven't gotten that part. I'm gonna look it up. I'm gonna look up some uh, some of the recipes, see what uh, we can do. If one of these uh, buildings out here can is viable, and we can do it that way, I'd rather do it that way. But if we can, uh, you know, not have to buy, you know, if we can uh, put a building on our own land, we'll do that. But I'm not sure where we're gonna do it. But yeah, that's, that's just kind of what my thought right now. And, uh, you know, of course, I'm getting ahead of myself as usual and uh, doing my, uh, I wish I had enough money to buy this stuff kind of thing, you know. But I am going to look, you know, in between episodes, I'm going to take a good look at it. And we're going to figure out what we can make with honey and what we can do with all that stuff. So, and then I'll... Uh, let you guys know what I'm thinking and uh, like I said with all that honey there there's a lot of stuff that can be made and I think we can use the sheep's milk if we need milk for right now distracted there at the end uh, but we're all done I was uh, my brain was working again and uh, I was thinking so um, we're gonna go down we're gonna get hooked up to the the planter and then I'm gonna go grab the trailer for um, with the bales on it we're gonna go sell them run back over and uh, Pick up that load and then we'll come back over here and do this job. And I might bring the John Deere over here to take this back to the farm because I can't take, you know, both machines over to the farm at the same time. I, I'm thinking we're just going to have to get another big tractor and we're going to have to keep this one for a little bit. Just, you know, even if it's just for transporting at the moment. I mean, this thing's super slow and everything, but, you know, it does do its job. All right, so... Get there. Okay, so we'll just leave that hooked up there. So, like I said, we're going to get this over to uh, the cell point. We're going to get the... The honey truck back and loaded and uh, then we'll go from there all right so we're back here at the farm I'm gonna try and get all these up here um I had problems getting out of here last time so if you're wondering why the tree's been cut that's why 
I was right up against the tree and I was uh I couldn't do nothing. Couldn't get out of there, so yeah. So I'm gonna back this in, you know, and uh we're gonna grab these ones that we already got on the other pad. Okay, so hopefully I, I can see it taking stuff so there we go so yeah this is gonna probably take a little bit to get this to uh to load all the other stuff so we're gonna see what we decide to do with this but uh we might just leave it sit here and let it pick up all the honey i haven't decided yet um I just want it so we're above the pad, but not uh, in the way. There we go. Okay, so we've already got the um, the tractor sitting over here ready to go. So, or I guess I'm so used to calling it a tractor trailer, you know, so you have to excuse me there. So I'm not sure if we have to just run over or... If this has one of those funky unload systems or what, so let's just see what happens when we hit unload. Helps if I hit Y. Okay, so I guess it does kind of do its job, so... As you notice, there was those weird ones up in the front. Um, I gotta get this one. But we just made about the same as what we made on the honey, you know, it's... What, we made 37 grand? So what I'm going to do is, oops, there we go. I'm going to run this back over. I mean, yeah, grass fields are only making us 148 plus the environmental bonus. But, you know, I think once we get everything going and start running everything the way it's supposed to be run, I think we'll get a lot more money. But, I mean, we made pretty good off the straw. I mean, we could actually return this trailer and and buy an actual copy of it that's ours if we really wanted to. You know, well, let's not do that. Let's just get this back over to the farm. And let's go from there. All this extra money, you know, from, you know. This thing's already paid itself off, you know. It cost us, you know, almost four grand to rent it. So we're kind of kicking butt with it. So I'm not going to complain. Oh, there we go. I didn't know we were going to get that one. Um... But if I remember correctly, this field had a ton of bales in it, and this can be mowed now again, so uh, that's kind of a positive there, stuff we can do. And I'm, I'm still definitely thinking about getting not a replacement for our main John Deere, but, uh, you know, the smaller one. I don't want to replace it, but I do want to get one that's better than the one we have. Okay, I guess our field ain't quite ready to be uh, mowed yet, but uh, probably by the time we uh, advance the clock once or twice, it'll be ready to go. I think probably on the next advance, it might be. And I know I keep saying this, but we need to uh, get this field done up so we can, uh, you know, get it all uh, plowed or something. Even if we just run around the whole field and plow the field so it's one field, it'd be better than nothing, you know? Let's see if I can get all three of these here. Yep, there we go. I think we can get this whole field on here. And I'm trying not to uh, time lapse this stuff, but if for some reason this gets too uh, lengthy or. I run out of things to say, <laughs> which both has happened. Um, believe it or not, I know you probably think, God, does this guy ever shut up? No, uh, that's why I love doing this, because I don't shut up. I don't know how. Um, anyway, <laughs> yeah, we're going to get as many of these bales off. After that, we're not going to worry so much about the bales. We'll probably bring the trailer back over here, load it up, and... Uh, leave it but we're not in a big monster hurry to get all of them done
Okay, what do we need? Two more? Or one? That's it. Okay, so I'm just going to uh, park it here on the lot again, and uh, like we did last time. But yeah, I see there's a couple out there. There might be a half, you know, not even, not a half a load, but like maybe a quarter of a load. So we will get this in a bit here when we're done with the other stuff. So how are we doing for this? Are we full? We are. Um, trying to decide. I don't want to take this over quite yet. I'd like to get, you know, closer to August, which is when honey's at its best. But I think we're going to uh, do this. This should, this should actually be pretty quick and easy. I mean, it's not, uh, this machine is big and we're going to have to at some point, we're going to have to bring the other uh, unit. We're going to have to bring the sprayer over and the, tr and the truck with the trailer. And we're going to have to uh, have both the, uh, I think what I'm trying to say without uh, being silly. Oh, um, we, we, we're going to need both fertilizer and uh, herbicide because uh, there's no way we're getting that done without it. Oh, there we go. I'm trying to do everything and talk at the same time. And sometimes that don't work well for me. Yeah, I definitely want to replace this thing. I don't like that we can't put fertilizer down at the same time. I mean, it's not that big of a deal bringing fertilizer. I mean, as you've seen in our shed, we got like, uh, what, like six, uh, six things of uh, IBCs of <laughs> fertilizer. We're just, <laughs> I bought way too much of it. But I want to kind of, I want to just kind of refrain from buying too much stuff right now. But at the same time, I want everything to advance, so we're going to have to start doing a little bit of buying. sure uh when we do the roller if we're gonna have to uh roll this or, you know, when we roll this field that this tractor has to run the roller or if we can get away with the john deere i mean we've been using the john deere just for uh transportation right now so uh but that's fine you know it's uh, still getting air time so <laughs> I, I don't know why i feel that every tractor i own i have to use and uh has to do something useful, you know, in that, you know, in the video each time, so, but I do, but, um, I'm gonna meet you guys over at, uh, the, um, <clears throat> sorry, my brain's not working, I'll meet you over at the hay, and we'll sell that, we may sell another load of honey, I don't know, I don't know how close we are to empty, but I'm gonna check on that in between here, and I will see you over there. Okay, so, uh, yeah, we're not going to sell that.
Alright, so it shouldn't take too long to get over there. All right, so we're just getting over here. I did check on the honey. We do not have, there's a, it's a full load, but there's very little left in the, the building itself. So I don't want to uh, worry about that. Let's set that to unload. Oh, okay. That's why <laughs> you have to do an unload. Okay, that's, that's cool, I guess. But, um, there's, yeah, but what, we got about 32, maybe a little more. Um, anyway, what I'm going to do is I'm going to send this trailer back. So, um, actually, I need to get purchase. Uh, that one. Um, we're going to rebuy this trailer when we're ready, but, uh, if we need it again, we can rent it again. So, let's go ahead and get our, uh. Get that returned. That definitely made us some money. I mean, it was definitely worth the, the four grand that we paid for it. So, you know, we're already at 124. I think we were at uh, nine when we rented it. So, uh, yeah, I think that's probably going to do us some good here. I'm going to take a look at a bunch of stuff in between episodes. And just see what we can do to make more money. You know, I want to see what we can do with the honey and uh, go from that point. You know, because I'm sure we can buy one of these business. I know that I know you can make like, uh, well, I think it's supposed to be like uh, a brand of honey nut Cheerios type of thing, and that's why there's honey in it. But uh, I think that's done with wheat and a couple other things. And uh, you know, we can start putting wheat on one of the fields and go from there. Um, but, uh, yeah, I'm not sure exactly. I'll have everything set up for tomorrow. Um, and we'll know what we're going to do, you know, what we're going to look into, uh, whether we're just going to save money to buy a business, we're going to save money to buy a tractor or what, you know, I don't need that trailer right away. And like I said, for what we made on that, we could easily spend the $4,000 again and, uh, get the trailer and if we need money we can always take honey in because it's those bees are always making honey for us but uh like i said we're going to be doing stuff over on this field but we need to start by rolling that one over there but uh if we can do it with the john deere we'll take the john deere over there and do it after we've done the you know or the cultivating over here but otherwise, we'll uh, we'll just have to do, finish that field and come cultivate and uh, go from there. But I will see you tomorrow, and uh, like I said, I'll uh, know what's going on more with what we're gonna buy and what we're gonna do. Uh, once we do sleep, I do believe the sunflowers will be ready. So we need to keep some of this money for for either buying the head or uh, renting it, and I think for right now we might buy it because there's going to be a there's going to be a corn job to do and a couple other jobs and i want to see if we can't do the jobs and make a little bit of extra money so i will uh see you guys next time